Hey, Jordan. Yeah? Come here. Okay. Hurry up. Ooh. <laughs> beep, beep. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> It's stinky. It smells really bad. What's up? week our mom was out here washing the hillside days and days and days and she started seeing this hip bone she's been so excited sending us pictures sending us pictures she's like gotta go get the hip bone gotta go get the hip bone it's out there it's coming it's I'm waiting and we're here and she's not here but that hip bone's ready to come out like so what do I do do I wait for my mom nope. what do I do we go get it all right <sighs> around it with Thank your you. hands or a hoe. Who are you calling hoe? Oh god. Drew's theory is this is thawed, it's just covered in mud. Yeah, the suction all that mud got it. It's very heavy. It's big. There's a lot of liquid coming from above. Going right through it. It's That's like um, Jurassic Park. Oh, yeah. When uh, the car slipped upside down and they're sinking in the mud, that's what's happening. Wow, look at it. It's yeah. so slimy. I know, it's like... Oh, wow. All right. Um, well, the thing is, it keeps ready? thawing into it. No, it's like, because it's suctioned to it. Oh. The clay has suctioned the bone in. Need my help? And it keeps filling. Do my help? Maybe. Just need some brute strength up in here. They, oh. they don't call me bucket girl for nothing. <laughs> Let me wash my hands in this clean water. Clean and filtered. Still stink. It still stinks. What are you doing, Drew? Getting a bucket of water so she can pour it on there. Okay. Still fro fro? Mm hmm. Still a little bit frozen. It goes a little bit further. So, getting water for this part because it's a pretty dense part of it. Wow, you see how far it goes in? Come on, oh, yeah. water. you can refill it right there. And I just need a little tool. Use my brain. Half a skull. Oh, you're so smart, Jordan. I'm kind of smart. I mean, I'm smart. No. Huh? I just know how to use this shovel in this bucket. Wow. Fill it with some water. That's awesome. Tomorrow I'll teach you how to uh, invent the wheel. The genius. <laughs> wow. Did you go to school for this? I did. <laughs> <laughs> Bucket school? Bucket school. Neat. Look how pretty that is. It's like hardly fossilized. It, it's in ice. Do you see? In ice. Do you see yeah. the ice? Yeah, I do see and the the ice. The bones right under it? Yep. I 
I think it's still gonna be a while. Mm. Goes up right here. Mm. Yeah, it's in there. Okay. Mom might be able to pull this out herself. Cool. Yeah. Right? That's what I, I thought at first, but I'm kind of confused. Right here. You can see, you can see a little like inner skull exposed, but I can't tell if this is portion of like step bison skull or what. Huh. It looks different, right? Yeah. Kind of like where the sheep would get attached, broken off. Huh. Lower mammoth has bone has leg bone has another bone attached to it. That's left that's definitely Man. Oh yeah, this is stinky. You got the rest of the skull in there? Yeah, I'm gonna flag right next to it so we don't hit it with the giant. Oops. <laughs> Let me see. Oops. <laughs> nice look. Thanks. Skull? There's a skull in here? Bison skull. You see the right next to it to the right? Oh yes. What do you think of this one, though, Laura? Oh, I don't think out. much, but when I do, oh, did Jordan get it? What's that? Making sure everyone's okay. Oh, nice. And then, Laura, we're oh. pretty sure that there's a good possibility a tusk is directly under this muck. Wow. You got a piece of ivory. Why do you think that? Because you found piece of ivory. Piece of ivory, and then. Uh, part of it's sticking out, but all this stuff sloughed off on top, so we gotta wash it. That's above our heads, by the way. Flat one, right? With the. Did you We're gonna that? go get that no. hip bone out. This is different, and I can't tell if it's With a, a giant. another bison skull or because if it's my mom's a here. Mammoth jaw. She wants it. Never bone alone. <laughs> no, it's scary sometimes. Yeah, always have protection. <laughs> So we are going to use the giant to clean up the mud down here, pick through, see what we find, and then wash away the overburden to make things safe again. So right now it's dangerous. <laughs>
cool.